Hello, my lovelies. So what do you think? I've just tried on my new nighty over on my Patreon. What do you think? I will try and do a review on it as well for you guys. But it won't be the same, <laughs> obviously. Right, where am I going? Smith's catalogue. It arrived. Yes. It arrived, I think, either yesterday or the day before. And the monkeys want to go to Smith's today. So I thought I would open it up and see if there's any coupons inside first. Because I like my coupons. I do. Right, so I'm going to sit down on the bed and open it up. Are you coming around? Are you staying there? Let's make sure this is in the right position. Oh, there's some pretty funky stuff on the back page. It's a good job it's not arriving today, this, because it would have got wet through, wouldn't it? Absolutely chucking it down with wet rain outside. I don't think there's any coupons. Okay, I want one of them. I want one of them. <laughs> we have one of them in the garage. We're gonna downsize all the toys, majorly downsize, and then we're gonna get wrap that up for Christmas because it was meant to be for last Christmas, and then she can have that out because she plays now. With the Barbies and the horses. There we go. Huh, I don't need to buy a Christmas present. I've got one in stock. <laughs> right. Ooh, £10 or below. I like these pages. I do. Telescope. How good can a telescope be, though, if it's £10 or under? We do have one, though, don't we? Mr. Potato. Ooh, paint your own giant unicorn. I know somebody would want to do that. <laughs> yeah, I tend to go to Smith's Toys with the kids and yeah, we don't want to look at these pages. Baby stuff. There's no more babies, so we don't want to look at these pages. So babies, I've got a coat, but we don't need anything like this. Oh yeah. Storytelling Mother Goose. Pick up a book and read your own daughter a story. All the kids stuff. Can you see okay? Can't you see? We don't want any baby stuff. I'm just flipping through all this because this is all little people. We're into bigger people now. She said, Little Miss said she wants a dog that walks on its own. Bit like a life pet unicorn that she's got. That I got for cheap. So there's a Fair Veal, the Lion King, Mighty Roar Simba here for £40. That one. Now, Fair Veal is the ones that do moving everything on their own baby shark do 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 no. you don't want that much stuff in or mini no pepper pig no deli dubbies no pepper pig moon and me oh that's a different one it's got to be a cbb's one though not it yeah see we're, we're past all these ones now kitty zoom Ooh, and they're like interactive talking world map. £20. They're any content with games, talking calculator, chalkboard, and over a thousand questions. Cool. What's that one? Bunch of balloons. Do I like balloons? <coughs> yeah, we've got a big map to put up, haven't we? Why? Because, hmm, why? Why? Because we want everybody's addresses no <laughs> i want everybody's email addresses to join a contact list for when i'm doing my special offers but also we want your locations so then i can write your either youtube or patreon name and your location and stick them on my map that's what we're going to be doing so there's a spoiler there for you two things that's coming up this year from adele sexy uk yes got no room for mini kitchens Ooh, we got room for these things there I'm terrible. I buy her too much. She's got loads of dolls. She doesn't need any dolls. And baby Born's expensive. Baby Annabelle's even more expensive. It's ridiculous how expensive Baby Annabelle is. A Baby Annabelle hospital, not including the doll, £60. £60! £60. £60. 
11 medical supplies. So there we go, let's read about it. Beautiful doll hospital with lots of medical accessories and a bed for your patient. Folds away for storage. Doll sold separately. The doll is £45. So you've got, what, £105 set there just for the doll and the hospital. But people must be buying it. That, I know, I know I've just said that, but that's what I would have liked for her. Because she's got lots of little cribs and things. But that is a Starlight Twinkles doll crib. And it's a canopy and it all twinkles, the canopy does, and it sings a lullaby to the dolls. That That's a possibility if she likes it. I'm not keen on the other things. Oh my God, look at the chops on them. Look at the chops. Oh, they're so cute. Lots to cuddle baby twins. 20 quid for the two. That's a bit better, isn't it? Missy Kissy. Push chairs. She's got two push chairs already. She did put that push chair in the shed, didn't she? It's not in the rain, is it? The twin one. Better not be in the rain. <gasps> Cabbage Patch Kids. <gasps> oh my God! When did they make a comeback? I want one for Christmas, Mr. Producer. I want a Cabbage Patch Kid. Please, please, can I have a Cabbage Patch Kid for Christmas? Why can't you see it? Can I have a Cabbage Patch Kid? They're only £30 each. It's saying now. Oh, it's so ugly, it's amazing. <laughs> God, they were out when I was little. <laughs> uh, as you can tell, I haven't looked in this book because <laughs> I'm kind of like looking and not showing you guys. My dream mentioned dollhouse, that doesn't look good. Oh my god, look at that. I wonder how big that is. Because the dolls are quite big, they are. They're about that tall, the dolls. I wonder how big that is. Because it's called car, there's a cruiser car, there's a scooter. I know there's a stables with a horse as well. Because I've seen that. They have a whole aisle of this in Smith's. Because look. It's to empower young ladies that they can be whatever they want to be. Basically, you need to buy a house just to set up their house. Because there's not a doll's house big enough because they're like real life ones. Because like I said, they're about that tall, the dolls. So all the wheelchairs and the, the school tables, everything has to be their size. Yeah. If we get a chance at Smith's, because I'm hoping to go there first, I'll show you. I'll do a little video in Smith's and I'll, I'll just show you. If it's not busy. That's a good idea, actually. Just to show you how big those dolls are. Look, there's the horse. Now, that doll has to get on that horse and not look daft. So, that horse is just as big as the doll. So, the horse is that tall for then the doll to sit on. It's ridiculous. The cord, our generation. Better not take her down the aisle with the horses. Because I can see... Yeah, they'll be coming home. We don't do a Sylvanian family. Thank God. Oh, they look nice. Big doll's house. Like I said, though, we've got one in the garage. Wrapped up in the box. The Barbie one. So if I downsize her toy boxes from five to two and get rid of a lot, then that would fit that in, wouldn't it? It would. I think it would. Yeah. I used to go nuts and I've, that is what she wants, spirit. She's only got a couple of them, yeah, but she, she wants the other sets of them. She wants the other horses to go with the spirit. So she wants horses, Harry Potter, horses, Harry Potter, and then that talking dog she says for Christmas. And I've already got her that set. Shh. Huh? Huh? Oh yeah. I did, um, was it that one? No, that was a different one. I bought that at a different time. I didn't buy that with you. That's already gone off to Santa's house. That one has. That, it's only £45 in Asda. £60 here in Smith's. The horse is about that tall. <laughs> it's a spirit riding for a deluxe walking spirit with Lucky. It, yeah, £45 in Asda. 
because Az has got their big toy sale on. And I'm hoping Smiths have started theirs today. <laughs> I'm hoping. God, if she stood at that door listening, <laughs> that was screwed. Lego? I want Lego. Lego Friends. I've got that Lego friend set to build up. <gasps> Look at the carousel! It goes to show though, if you shop around, it's like you wouldn't expect Asda to be cheaper than Smith. Because Smith's is probably the cheapest toy store, I would say. Even our, it's even cheaper than Argos. And that's saying something. On certain things, there's always that leeway. You've got to shop around. Polly Pocket. Polly Pocket, I was out in the 90s. Polly Pocket. Ooh. No. Can't remember Polly Pocket. She fits in your pocket because she's tiny. She's a Polly Pocket. You can literally fit them in your school bag look and then you could play with them at school on lunch breaks or something there's just me has it and then Polly Pocket's about that big inside them because <laughs> she fits in your pocket that's the point well, who are they BTS have we ever heard of BTS they look like a Japanese singing group to me Hedda Hippo and Lake Doll Oh no, that's the Enchantimals. Sorry, BTS. So you got the V doll, Sugar Idol, Jin Idol, Jungkook Idol, RM R M Idol, Jimin Idol, and the J Hope Idol. I'm, I'm taking it they're the latest craze with the teeny boppers. I'm a bit old for a teeny bopper nowadays. Right, so we're on to Barbie. Barbie. That's a Barbie. Oh, we Smiths. Oh, that's a nice little set, a swing set. That's a nice little set. I'll have to have a look at that today. She's already got a wardrobe because her grand bought her that many moons ago. She got the unicorn last year because her auntie bought her that. Oh, that's a new one. That's a new unicorn. Let's have a look at that one. Uh, that's the one that I bought recently from Asda. That set. Where you get the two dolls, two ponies and the stable and everything. So how much is it in Smiths? It's 49.99 in Smiths. And I got it for 30 in Asda. Yeah, I got it for 30. Again, 20 quid cheaper. But they've got their big toy event on already, see Asda. So how much is number five? Ooh... Barbie Dreamtopia, Magical Light Unicorn and Doll is £40. We'll ask Auntie for that again. <laughs> I'm buying this set. Hey. Oh, there's a carriage one here, though. Number 11. £50. Includes two Barbie Dreamtopia princess dolls, a carriage with rolling wheels and a unicorn. Yeah. It's going with Barbies. Have I really been talking about a Smith's catalogue for that long? <laughs> Am, am I getting too engrossed? This is only the girl stuff. We only have one girl. We have two boys. And I never know what to buy them. Oh, she has asked for the LOL dolls in the bigger sizes. She has this year. They're in Asda as well. They're £30 here. They're cheaper than that in Asda, aren't they? They were cheaper than £30 in Asda. I'm sure they were. God, they've really gone bad on LOL again. That's the second page of it. Yes. And then they're trying to take on Barbie this year, though, because they've got the bigger ones. LOL surprise glitter globe. God, look at the houses. That's a new house this year. Includes exclusive doll, bro, and pet. Oh, yeah, they started doing boys. LOL dolls now do the boys section. So, right, for the doll's house, which includes a doll, a bro, and a pet, it's £250. <laughs> My God! Oh, right, what's this? LOL Surprise, Amazing Surprise. 14 exclusive dolls inside, plus 70-plus surprises. Follow the maze to unbox £130. But that's not bad. If you think about how much all of those 70 things inside would cost... That's not a bad price. That'll go. You'll see a lot of YouTube reviews on that. A lot of kid, a lot of the kids' channels will have that on as a review. I can already, already name one channel that I know will have that on. 
Tiana's. Straight away, that will be on there. Because she's LOL doll mad. <laughs> I, I, I watch her through Little Miss. I do. Uh, it's not that I like her. <laughs> I do. I like her channel. She's funny. I don't get poopsie. I don't understand it. She's No, I don't do slime. We don't do slime in this house. Oh, God, why? Goo Goo Galaxy Maker Kit. Goo Goo Galaxy Maker Kit. No. No, we, we will stick with the normals. She likes twisty pets as well. She likes too many things. She needs to stay off YouTube. She needs to stay off Tiana's channel. <laughs> Candy locks, I've seen them in Asda. Hair adorables, seen them. Now, come on, they do look adorable, don't they? I think it's the eyes that do it. They, they really do look pretty. <laughs> it's got to be the eyes. Okay, we're still in. Right, she was mentioning a Hatchimal with a unicorn horn. Get ready, something big is hatching on October the 1st. Hatchimals, wow. £80. £80. £80 for a Hatchimal. Who has this kind of money these days? I don't. But yeah, she was mentioning the one with a horn. Blue. Can't see the, who is that then? Pomsies yummies. They've got horns. I don't think so. No, I can't, can't see it. Right. So now we're on to the animals that move and everything. There, there's a llama. There's a llama. Pets alive. Boppy and Booty shaking llama. Oh, he shakes his butt. It's only twenty quid. Can I have him for Christmas, please? Mm. Can you say no? I want a bopping boopy llama. A bopping boopy llama. If there's a sloth, we're getting it. <laughs> oh, that looks so adorable. Oh, it plays peekaboo. It plays peekaboo. It reacts to your voice, responds when you feed him. Oh, I really shouldn't go down the fur, the fur wheel aisle today at Smith's. Oh, oh my God, it looks dog. Right, where, where's this dog? That should... There's a sloth. There's a sloth. Sloths are my spirit animals. Club Pets, Mr. Slew. £30. Mr. Slew is your new funny friend. Press his belly to hear him repeat what you say super slowly. Hello. Can you, I, I, how do you think you would say Adele Sexy UK? Because you have to say that quite quick. <laughs> so I haven't seen a dog. He's only £30. So I've seen three things I would like. <laughs> do any other parents and adults do this at Smith's? You can have that one, I want that one. <laughs> He's too adorable though. Why are you getting in the belly? Can't see the dogs that she was on about. No, they're just teddies. <gasps> There's a giant husky. Big Ted is £65. We got him for £20. Pardon? Is he a boy or a girl? I think he's a girl. He's not got any bits. Presuming he's a girl. Big Ted wants a girlfriend, does he? Yeah, well, Big Ted can have her then. £15. She's smaller. You, you, you like your girl smaller, so he's smaller. Oh, God, look at that. That is adorable. I'm terrible. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Horse club. Uh-oh. Oh, God. They're so expensive though. No, I don't like them. They're the new horse club that Smith's is doing. Yeah, that one. Is it Schleck? Is that how you say it? Schleck, maybe. They're too expensive, they are. Thank God. I don't like them anyway. The horses don't look right. Yep. Uh oh. Harry Potter. I keep saying uh oh. Harry Potter. Harry Potter. 
I don't know why she's gone on to Harry Potter. She's not seen all the videos before you say anything, anybody? She hasn't. Right, we're starting on boy stuff now, it's boring. <laughs> Wait, it's kiddies boy stuff, I don't want kiddies boy stuff. I don't know what they're gonna want, you know. You only play Lego on the Xbox. You don't play anything else. They don't play Transformers, they don't play with cars. <gasps> How to train your dragon Hatchimal. Oh, you can have your own toothless. Fifty pound. You hatches. You had to be hatches. Okay, I think I like a boy thing. Why is that a boy thing though? Shouldn't there should be a girl thing, a universal and a boy thing. In the catalogues. Don't do WWE. Roblox. We like Roblox. Not bad. Not bad prices either. Mix and match. Roblox Phantom Forces Game Pack. $12.99. Don't know which one they'll want though. He'll want the jailbreak SWAT unit one. £20. Because he likes his police. Cops and robbers. Hey, you get quite a lot. What'd you get in that? Recreate Epic Breaks Out from Bedemo's jailbreak game with four figures, an ATV, a ramp, exclusive virtual item, codes and accessories. So is that the vehicle then, the ATV? Do you get the vehicle? Answer the question. Do you get the vehicle? If you get the vehicle, that's quite good. Minecraft. And they've gone back into their Minecraft. Thank you, Xbox. Pika! Pikachu! Fortnite. Fortnite used to be huge in this household. Last year, they had the manuals, everything. This year, eh, don't like it. I don't know. They've gone into Minecraft more. You know? Which is a pain because he could have had all this and I would have known what to buy him. But no. He's changed his mind. Nerf. So he could have had Fortnite Nerf guns. Only at Smith's. Nerf Fortnite RL. Number five. Load the rocket, prime the blaster and press the trigger to fire. Includes two elite rockets. Haha, <laughs> cool. Nerf rival face mask here as well now. Got face masks. Quite cool. Okay, page. There is a Nerf aisle as well though, isn't there, Linda Smith? Oh, that looks good. Strike attack. Nerf alpha strike fang jewel pack. 9 99 Includes two fangs, QS4 blasters, four half targets, 12 elite darts. Should I get, I think you get two guns. Can't get two guns for 9.99, can you? Oh, you like the big one. The Nerf and Strike Elite, elite Titan, 79.99. Fully motorized spinning barrel, shoulder strap included. <laughs> I knew you'd like that one. Do you want that one for Christmas? How many darts? Let's have a look, Let's see if I can find it. It's, uh, this colossal blaster is fully motorised for rapid fire dart blasting. Includes 50 elite darts. So I'm presuming you load that up. You load that bit up down there because that's the only bit that will come on. Are we looking at the nerf guns today as well, Mr. Producer? Oh, that one's quite good. Nerf and strike. So you put three bullets in there, lock it in and they shoot out all in one go. Okay, they're the laser ones. Don't do lasers. Don't do lasers. King Kong? Is King Kong still a thing? Dinosaurs. Dinosaurs are always a thing. Whether Jurassic Park's just been released or not. Tractors? Want a tractor? Got a tractor. Dumper trucks? We used to have all of them. Hot wheels. No more matchbox. So all Hot Wheels now. Do, we, do they not do Matchbox anymore? Pardon? It's all the same, Hot Wheels and Matchbox. It's not. Bosch Monster Jam. Scale Electrics. 
Fast and the Furious. You want to go back one? That one looks pretty cool because you've got ramps and everything. Furious Challenger Road Racing Set, £30. It's not the official scale electrics. You want the official scale electrics. I don't know if we've got official scale electrics. We will find out. Robotic things. Things that flip. You got you got to remember we've had all these. We've had quite a lot of these already. We still have got quite a lot of these already somewhere. Yeah, we've done the train. We've done the drones. What's these ones? Funko. Funko verse. DC Comics Funko verse game four pack. With a snap of his fingers, the Mad Titan has arrived. Get your hands on a villainous addition to your Marvel collection. Oh, that's um, a pop. Is that a pop? It's a Funko, so I don't know. I wonder what the game is. Complete Missions is your favourite character in a brand new strategy game. It includes figures, characters and item cards, dice and double-sided boards. Different. It looks complicated. Ooh, Lego. Where, where are you going? You can't sh I can't look at the book now if you've gone over there. I've got to show you. Go back over there. I'm, I'm going to still look at the book myself. I've got so much Lego. <gasps> Lego City Donut Shop opening. <laughs> and then we're just going to have to show them around Smith's today. Lego movie. We've never watched the Lego movie too, you know. We've still not watched it. How bad is that? We keep saying that we're major into Lego and we've never watched it yet. In fact, have we even built... My tag showing. It's because I'm going to leave the tag on until I do a YouTube review on the nighty. Have we... We haven't built the Lego movie stuff that we bought. We got given a builder thing, didn't we? It's in the, I bet it's in the garage in them bags. It's because we need to get back to building our girl. I know it's time-wise because it takes me forever. But we do. Because we've got so much Lego to build. and uh, yeah. But then it all gets dismantled. And it's heartbreaking. Because I'll spend hours building something. And then within half an hour, it's gone. Yeah, and I always film it with you guys, don't I? <gasps> Harry Potter Lego. I like my castle. I want to build my castle. Lego, that's still not gone down in price. Millennium Falcon, £650 for a, a proper Millennium Falcon. Well, yeah, I bet a lot of people have gone hung up. But you get a lot of figures with it. You do get a lot of figures with it. But you get more with the Death Star. Go figure. It's three hundred. It's two hundred and fifty pound more the Millennium Falcon to the Death Star, but you get more figures. We've got tons of Minecraft Lego as well to build. Right, Stranger Things. I'm a bit disappointed in Stranger Things Lego. Stranger Things is a huge TV program. I don't know if you've watched it. All right, it is very freaky, but it's a really good program. We got invited down to London because we're Lego VIPs. Yes, we are. We're in the club. Oh, yes, we are. Um, for this huge launch of a mysterious Lego. But it was happening at one o'clock in the morning in Piccadilly Circus. No, Leicester Square in London. We're not going to Leicester Square at one o'clock in the morning in London. No. So we didn't go. We then went to the Lego shop in Sheffield. And it was the only released one piece. So... We would have gone all the way down to London, had all the hype and everything for one piece of Stranger Things Lego. And it's like they've not even released the figures though, either. They should have released the figures in Lego and a big piece and the vehicle on its own, I think. Because all that does is you build it and then you, flip, you can flip it so then you go to the other world. So it is like two game sets in one and you get the vehicle but no, you could have done so much more. It's £180. But they could have done so much more. They could have released loads and they would have sold. They would have. But they released a friend set as well. You have the couch. 
from Central Park. Camper van. Roller coaster. That roller coaster works, you know. It's got a motor. It actually goes around with all the Lego figures in. Ooh, Games of Thrones Lego. Ah, oh, it's not Lego. Mega Constructs. Wanna be Lego. See, Lego also doesn't do like army vehicles and things. So I've bought other army vehicles. It's never the top quality like Lego is. Never. It's like Titanic. Is that Titanic? I built that on camera. I don't know where it is now. It's dismantled, I think. It's sunk. <laughs> Playmobil. See, I keep thinking that Playmobil is really good because they do completely different things to Lego. But then they do the same as well. They've got Ghostbusters here, police stations and everything. But they do. It's not in here. They do a fairy collection as well. A fairy in unicorn land. And I would love that one. Ooh, gravitics. Move on to the science now. Robotic hedgehog. Cool. Ah, build a bot unicorn. Build a bear workshop, you can build your own bears. Stuff it real good. Yep. Aquadabras. What is that? So soap DIY soap factory. You can make your own soap. So magic DIY wonder magic garden. Oh, that is lovely. It remind, it's like them Zen gardens where you have the um, little pitchfork to move the sand to be tranquil. Paint your own unicorns here. Paint your own Russian dolls. Oh, I like that one. Oh, look at that art set. <laughs> a terrible art set. Slime. Don't do slime. Move along. So many different things that like they can make and things, it's ridiculous. Sugar and snail stationary with imagination. Ooh. Crayola light up tracing pad. This book is only probably a quarter of what Smiths actually do though, isn't it? They, they have so much, it's ridiculous. Jenga, Jenga, Jenga's a good one. Jenga is a good one. We should get Jenga. All these games, so many different games. Electronic arcade, crazy golf. How do you do crazy golf by hand? Well, that's a good set. Yeah, all your classics. Chess. Oh, I don't know what that one is. Drafts. I don't know what the other two are. And that looks very good. Santa's rooftop Scrabble. <laughs> jigsaws. Lots and lots of jigsaws. I've seen a jigsaw I want to get, actually, in the works. It's only £4. Unicorn's Vanity Box 3D Puzzle. <gasps> um, I like that. I can't see your mouth, what? Shop book. Chocolate. Shock. What? A book. I don't know what he's saying. A book on... Sharks. Just say it. S oh. What? J Jokes Joke book They might have one We'll have to look in store They don't tend to have them in here But I like this What's this one? Uh, number 8 It's a unicorn's vanity box Create a sturdy storage box With sliding tray Using 216 shaped Hinged and numbered puzzle pieces Could build that up on video And then you get a vanity box At the end of it Jokes. We've got a um, believe it or not books. Fantastic history facts. 
Animal Encyclopedia. Tom Gates, what monster? No, there's no joke books in here. We're after a joke book. But all your little right oh god, she saw that. Why? So when I do my lives I can read jokes out. 120, 199.99. A very unrad own unicorn. No, it won't fit me. Bikes? They all have bikes. Scooters? We all have scooters. We've even had them before. Oh, we've never had that. We've never had that. And then that'd be too big for too small for an out there, wouldn't it? We've never had that. That would have been in the Christmas pile, that would have if that had been out when she was littler. Oh my god, that is awesome. Skateboards don't do A and A. Basketball. Basketball. Are you wanting just one that fixes on the wall? There. Sixteen ninety nine. Basketball and ring. Ball set. Sixteen ninety nine. It's not bad. Bring it closer. Mm. Number fourteen. Forty seven centimeters regulation size steel rim with net. Pump an official size seven ball. Fittings included. Oh, excuse me. Snooker tables, outdoor playhouses, want to be in a rock band, yeah. karaoke machines, all right, all right, we don't have a PS4, we have an Xbox One, <sighs> they want a new Xbox, don't they, for the living room, don't they, so right, we don't want all digital, because we want to be able to play DVDs in there. So here you get Xbox One S. Right, Xbox One, Xbox One S, one terabyte, Forza Horizon 4, and Lego Speed Champions console bundle. Bundle includes Xbox One console, Xbox One wireless controller, Forza Horizon 4 full game digital download, Lego Speed Champions expansion digital download, one month Xbox Pass. That's no good. Don't want that. There's no prices. Why is there no prices on the Xbox Ones? Ah, you've got to see in store. So here's a good one. Xbox One console, two Xbox One wireless controllers. And that's what we want, isn't it? I might have a look how much that is in store today. Well, where's the games? Oh, here's some. Borderlands 3, Ghost Recon. There's no prices. There's no prices on any of the games even. Competition, you think? Okay. Gaming chairs. Headphones. <gasps> you can have your own Pac-Man. Oh my God. Pac-Man cabinet included riser. All include risers. Oh, you can have a gaming stool. I can't even tell you how much. It's coinless operation as well. So you don't have to pay. Obviously you have to pay for it. Uh, Pac-Man. At just under four feet tall, this Pac-Man cabinet provides hours of retro fun. Outrun the ghosts and collect pack dots while navigating Pac-Man through the maze. Includes Pac-Man and Pac-Man Plus. It doesn't tell you how much. That's infuriating. What? Well, it would be really good for the Lego room. Could do Space Invaders as well. <gasps> can I have both? Don't want Street Fighter. You can either get Street Fighter, Pac-Man or Space Invaders. Can we have all of them? <laughs> Please. Please! Fitbit Ace for kids. Oh, cool. Just get them a normal Fitbit. Why do you need them for kids? Right, that's the Smith's book. It took me a long time to do that, didn't it? <laughs> I enjoyed that though, I did. We're off to Smith's now, we're gonna get changed. Yeah, so I'm gonna do a change of video over my Patreon and then we, the next ones you'll probably see is a little bit in Smith's, yes. So thank you for watching my lovelies. Don't forget to like it for me, 
subscribe, hit the subscribe button, you know you want to. Follow me on my Twitter and my Instagram, UK. Check out my amazing Patreon for only a dollar a month. You get to support my YouTube channels and you get to see the full review on this nighty. Because it went on my dollar tier. It did. So come on over, guys. Check it out. Google me at R6UK Patreon or come through the links that are on my Twitter and Instagram at R6UK. Goodbye for now.